Yo, what up guys? Welcome to your one-stop shop for cops. This is Kevin, and I'm stepping in with another sneaker news. I think this is the fifth one, but uh, yeah, I just headed to, uh, I, I just moved real quick. So yeah, that's why I haven't had a video on uh, this past Wednesday. Yeah, anyway, so, so we had a lot of collabs in the meantime. Um, especially ones dropping uh, today and yesterday. So uh, yesterday we actually had the uh, Kendrick Lamar drop with his uh, neutral, and that was a classic leather. I think he had a classic leather two years ago as well, but uh, this one's really innovative with its, uh, with its only half design. I, only, I know I mentioned it earlier, but I thought I would mention it again because I took a really bad L on that. Like, Okay, so I was actually on the website and I was like, yeah, maybe I'll just, uh, pretend that I want to cop this today and uh, yeah I, I tried to cop it but then like didn't work out so uh, yeah there it goes <laughs> it was $110 but uh, if you want to get it now you can expect to pay retail so yeah also the question mid came out with another edition of only the strong survive again this is an Allen Iverson shoe and it has some Kevlar materials and reflective materials but uh, in my opinion, like the bright orange upper and the white uh, midsole, like that's just not my style. But I think it's a really cool shoe. Like they they keep on just pushing out these great shoes with uh, with Allen Iverson. And I think if I had to choose one out of all the ones that have came, come out right now, I would have to get the All Star Weekend, uh, the yellow and blue one. Yeah, I'm not sure why um, I'm not sure why Allen Iverson would just like not wear that shoe for his all-star game but I'm sure he has his reasons so uh, next thing up is the Mita they had a collaboration with the phase one pro this shoe featured a wood grain kind of look and it looks really cool in my opinion and it's hundred twenty dollars um, personally like I I'm not one to really cop collaborations but yeah if, if I'm really interested I think I'll grab these uh, on the sale end of things if they get, come down to it <laughs> yeah next we have actually have a GR that I was really interested in the, the Fury Adapt is a new shoe that's coming out. It's like, it's more complete than the Fury Light, in my opinion. So it's it's like more complete of a shoe. There aren't any holes or anything like there are in the Fury Light. But um, yeah, um, it has a very athletic feel. Like the 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 midsole and the outsole are much like the uh, the Instapump Fury, which I really like. Yeah, so I'm, I'm hoping it'll be a more affordable version of the Instapump Fury. Lastly, we have a collaboration with Major and the Phase 1 Pro as well. So we have two, two shoes in the Phase 1 Pro category today. And uh, it's the Stars and Stripes, which actually comes out today on Saturday. Um, and I think it's really dope and well executed in my opinion. Um, yeah, they're, they're really bright red shoes. So you're gonna have to like tone down your outfit so that people can notice these shoes. Um, but I think you'll have no problems with that. So uh, yeah, that's sneaker news for this week. Thanks for stopping by your one-stop shop for cops. Uh, I'm Kevin. I'm signing out. This is California. There's still no clouds. See ya.